We're coming into the holiday season now that we're into November, and we want to talk about uh, the activities through the Morris Chamber of Commerce. And Summer Anderson joins us to tell us more about that. She is the director, and you're in your new offices now. Yes, we're in the Greeley Plumbing Building, um, and we are settled in and nice um, with the SCEIC is in here as well. So it's a nice place for us to be. You've got a big night on the 18th. Tell me about the Parade of Lights. Yes, November 18th at 5.30, we'll be having the Parade of Lights down Atlantic Avenue, starting from 10th to 1st. Mm -hmm. And uh, registration is still open. Yep, you can register still. Go to the Chamber website, um, or we shared it on Facebook as well, and there's a link that you can fill out online, and that'll get you registered. Um, we are so thankful for the Lions group. They help us with all the organization of the You'd be surprised how much goes into who's having music, the size of the float, that sort of thing. And so they organize all of that for us. Yeah. So it's so helpful. Yeah. You don't want to put all the loud things all in one place and then just have a whole quiet stretch, yes. right? Yeah. Yep. Yep. So, um, yeah, the 18th, that'll be happening. And then um, we'll also be having the brand new snowflakes that we have on the light posts. Mm -hmm. um, many businesses in town donated to that. And so we have all brand new lights. It's going to be really nice. Um, so it's really going to be festive this year. Now, is that something the businesses only bought, or do you get some money from else, other places? Yep, a few individuals um, mm -hmm. donated as well, and we're gonna during the parade, we'll announce um, and and be posting on Facebook and sharing just how thankful we are that so many people donated to that. Well, in addition to the Parade of Lights, what other kind of activities are you doing that day? So that same night um, is the kickoff for Lights on the Prairie. If people aren't familiar with that, there's an organization in town that um, individuals that got together that have been going out of town for a drive-through light display. And they thought, why are we going to Wilmer and Alexandria? Let's have something like this in Morris. So at the um, fairgrounds that night, right after parade of lights they'll be kicking off their lights on the prairie and so you just drive through and it's it's going to be pretty pretty neat all right yeah kevin williamson is uh one of the organizers for this um yep there's tino harris kevin williamson um julie evink um, and maybe others i'm not on that committee so i don't know for sure um, but they've just been working with getting donations personally and through businesses and so they they got quite a bit um, I think they went over their expected goal and so it's going to be a really cool I think there's a big um, tunnel thing that you drive through the buildings are decorated on the outside um, I think maybe there's going to be like a synchronized music to um, the lights you know as they go mm -hmm. so um, I think it's going to be a really neat thing a new thing in Morris that people will come here to see right again and if anybody, if anybody has any questions, they can go to the website, and uh, that's pretty easy to do. Just type in Morris uh, Chamber of Commerce, and uh, it'll pop up in yep. your Google. It'll pop up. Otherwise, morrismnchamber.org. Um, we're on Facebook as well, or stop in the Chamber office, and we can help you. Well, happy holidays. Happy holidays. All right. And again, Summer Anderson has been our guest here on KMRS, KKOK, and our monthly newsletter.